Good day, students. It is another week for another discussion, so I hope you are all ready. As I have mentioned last meeting, Unit 2 is all about Afro-Latin and popular music. We have already discussed about African music, so today we will be moving on to another topic, which is Latin American music. Latin America refers to the entire region of South America, in addition to Mexico, Central America, and Caribbean islands. The people in this region speak Spanish, Portuguese, Italian, and Romanian. Almost all countries under Latin America or America were colonized by Spain or Portugal which resulted to the fusion of the different cultures and traditions. In, in, the, part, in the past, uh, Latin American music was used mainly for rituals and music accompanied by dance movements. When Spaniards and Portuguese colonized the region, they brought uh, Catholicism with them and introduce new kind of music, which are the religions, religious and secular music. Religious music refers to the songs taught together with Catholicism, which were easily adapted by Latin Americans. On the other hand, secular music was used to celebrate hard work such as planting, harvesting, which later on incorporated in their native dance traditions. Latin American's musical instruments were combinations of outside influences and either indigenous culture. So here are the musical instruments of Latin Americans. Let's start with the string instruments, which basically means instruments, instruments which uses a string to make sounds. A charango, it is a guitar like in instruments with five chords with multiple strings. Its body is made from armandillo shell. Next one is berimbau. It is bow like instrument which originated from Africa. It has only one string and also known as musical bow. The second are the wind instrument which makes use of air to create sound. A, and number one is flutes, where the predominant wind instrument and the famous flutes were piccolos, vertical pipes with whistle sound. And andin quena, whistle type flute with end notches. Pan pipes were also uh, prevalent and some well-known pan pipes which circularist and zampona. Trumpets also played important role in the primitive Latin American music. Well-known trumpets are Latin and truk truka. The third one are the percussion instruments which make sounds when an outside force is applied on its surface. Bambos are the double-headed drum made of hollow wood and animal fur. Maracas are instruments that produce sound when shaken uh, conga, conga drums originated from Africa which are characterized as tall, narrow, and single-headed. 
the scraper is made of bone with so like surface and rust with a stick and was commonly used in reggae music. Now let's discuss the Latin American vocal dance form. The first one is the cubia, which is known for its vers versatility and integration of ad lib movement where everyone can be the center of the dance. It is commonly performed in uh, circles and uses uh, tambours, maracas, and flutes. The second one is tango, which is a musical style that involves ballroom and song. Tango can be spirited or lively or melancholic and lonely. Rumba is an Afro-Cuban folk song which is characterized by its subtle sidestep and hip movements. Okay, the next one is the Foxtrot, which is known for its extensive and continuous movements on the dance floor. It can either be fast or slow depending on the music depending on the music. So Foxtrot basic steps includes walking steps, chases, and quarter turns. Next is Paso Doble, which is a dramatic Spanish dance that uh, it imitates the bullfighting tradition in Spain. This requires arrogant and adoring portray portrayal dance steps. Next is Bossa Nova, which is a musical style that combines samba and cool jazz. It is considered as popular music founded by Antonio Carlos Jubim and João Gilberto. The last one is the reggae. It is a popular musical style that represents Jamaican music. It originated from traditional Jamaican music uh, SKA or SKA. It is known for its upbeat rhythm and staccato chords. So, these are the vocal and dance form of Latin America. Since we have talked about reggae music, we should mention a popular artist who made reggae a hit. He is Bob Murphy, who is a Jamaican composer and singer who was known to be one of the pioneers of the introduction of reggae to the international music scene. He combined rhythm and blues, rock and unconventional form of reggae. His lyrics often spoke about personal uh, truths. Legends become the best-selling reggae album after his death. Okay, so I hope you understood our lesson. I'll see you next meeting. Stay safe. Good day and God bless.